In this video, we're going to reveal the seven things that will happen to your body when you eat eggs every day. When it comes to foods with confusing health messages, eggs may take the cake. Health experts warned for years against eating them on a super regular basis for fears that doing so could raise cholesterol and contribute to heart disease. But in recent years, research has shown that eggs really aren't dangerous to heart health after all. So is it really okay to eat eggs every day? What happens to your body when you eat eggs? Could they even help with weight loss? Stay tuned to find out my thoughts on it as a registered nutritionist. Before we dive in, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to join my community and if you know anyone that might benefit from this video, please share. Let's get to the truth about nutrition together. Number one, when you eat an egg, you'll feel energized. What came first, the chicken or the egg? The age old question, but what we know for sure is that a whole egg contains all the nutrients required to turn a single cell into a baby chicken. Eggs are among the most nutritious foods on the planet and can give you the energy to start the day. Because of the nutrient composition, they're a good source of energy. One egg provides around 77 calories, 6 grams of protein and 5 grams of healthy fats. Eggs are a complete protein containing all 9 essential amino acids necessary to rebuild muscles and tissue in our bodies. Depending on size, one egg has anywhere between 5 to 8 grams of protein and nearly everything in our bodies requires protein. And it contains a lot of vitamins and minerals such as vitamin D, vitamin A, vitamin B2, vitamin B12, folate and iodine. Keep watching to find out what these vitamins and minerals in eggs do to your body. Number two, eggs maintain your immune system. Eggs are a good source of vitamins and minerals such as vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin E and selenium, all of which are key for maintaining proper immune system function. Eggs are particularly high in selenium, a powerful antioxidant that also helps to maintain your immune system. Antioxidants like selenium also have an anti-inflammatory effect, reducing the need for immune system involvement. Both of these antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties take care of things that the immune system would otherwise have to handle. Basically, since there's only so much your immune system can tackle, selenium helps to free it up so that it can fight other threats. Number three, improves your brain function. Eggs are high in choline. What is choline? Choline is a nutrient that helps to transfer signals between nerve cells, so it's pretty good for your brain. It's an essential nutrient, meaning that the amount produced by the body is not enough to meet requirements, so you need to get choline from your diet to avoid deficiency. This nutrient may be especially important for pregnant women, Studies show that a low choline intake can raise the risk of neural tube defects and lead to decreased cognitive function in the baby. Eggs also contain a lot of vitamin B12. It contains a whopping 46% of the recommended daily value for vitamin B12. Vitamin B12 does a lot of things to your body. It helps make your DNA and your red blood cells as well as proper functioning of the nervous system. Low levels of B12 have been linked to mood and brain disorders like depression and dementia. In other words, Eating eggs on the regular can play a part in supporting your mental health too. Number four, helps your heart. Yes, you heard me right, eggs may actually help your heart. For years, it was thought that eating eggs on a regular basis could raise cholesterol and contribute to heart disease. Eggs do have cholesterol, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Before I go any further, let me explain what cholesterol is all about. Cholesterol is an essential structural component of every cell in your body. Years ago, it was thought that eating cholesterol would naturally raise your blood cholesterol. It turns out your liver makes cholesterol based on how much you eat, so you can't very effectively change your cholesterol level through diet. There are two main types of cholesterol, HDL and LDL. HDL is known as good cholesterol because it can help your body get rid of cholesterol by transporting it to your liver. LDL is often referred to as bad cholesterol because it carries cholesterol to your arteries where it can build up in the artery walls and eventually lead to heart disease. Yes, research suggests that eating foods that are high in dietary cholesterol like eggs can raise a person's cholesterol a little bit. But eggs raise the HDL, the good one, to a greater extent than it does the LDL, the bad one, which is a good thing. Research in recent years has failed to find a connection between one a day egg consumption and heart disease, even in people whose genetics put them at a higher than normal risk. A 2018 study published in the journal Heart suggests that eating eggs may even have a protective effect. People who reported eating up to one egg per day had an 11% lower risk of developing heart disease and an 18% lower risk of dying from it over the following nine years than those who did not eat eggs. This adds to the evidence that eggs aren't bad for you after all. Number five, eating eggs could help you lose weight. Eggs can play a role in supporting your weight loss efforts, depending on how you're preparing them and what you're eating them, of course. How? 
Well, eggs are a nutrient-rich whole food and a source of both protein and fats. Protein and fats can help provide a feeling of satisfaction from a meal that will last longer than if you had consumed one low in protein and fats and can therefore help manage your overall daily caloric intake. In fact, multiple studies have shown that people who eat eggs for breakfast, yolks included, not only feel more full but also consume fewer calories in later meals compared with people who ate a bagel for breakfast. An egg white contains just about 17 calories and 0.1 grams of fat while the yolk typically contains around 55 calories and 4.5 grams of fat. An egg meal like an omelette with vegetables usually consists of about two to four eggs. So if we take the average of three eggs that will give you around 215 calories and with a general serving of vegetables you'll be able to have a complete meal for only about 300 calories so you'll be getting a lot of nutrients for not too many calories just keep in mind that if you fry your eggs in oil or butter you add about 50 calories for each teaspoon used so eggs can definitely be part of your diet if you're aiming for weight loss since they're high on the satiety index which may prevent you from needing to nibble on more food between meals and they are low in calories it's a win-win Number six, eggs can help to build healthier bones. Whole eggs are also a good source of calcium and vitamin D. Vitamin D, also known as the sunshine vitamin, as it is the only nutrient your body produces when exposed to sunlight. A typical egg yolk contains about 5% of your daily need of vitamin D. Getting enough of both vitamin D and calcium is crucial to maintaining bone health. So if you're not getting enough sunshine, it's important to try and get your vitamin D from foods such as eggs. Finally, number seven, eggs can help to protect your eyes. Egg yolks are one of the best sources of lutein, a pigment that has been linked to better eyesight and lower risk of eye disease. There are two types of lutein found in the retina of the eye, where it can protect the retina from light damage by working as a blue light filter, as exposure to light makes the eye deteriorate. Eggs are also full of vitamin A, which is one of the most important components of a healthy eye function. When you have an egg a day, your eyes will thank you for it. So how many eggs can you eat a day? Well, there's no recommended limit on how many eggs people should eat. Current health guidelines show that eating an egg each day does not have detrimental health effects and actually provides many health benefits. Eggs can be enjoyed as part of a healthy, balanced diet, but it's best to cook them without adding salt or fats. For example, boiled or poached without added salt, scrambled without butter and using no fat milk instead of cream. Is eating raw eggs safe? The safety concern is around a germ called salmonella on the shell or inside the egg that can make you sick, especially if you eat raw or lightly cooked eggs. In the UK, the Food Standards Agency previously had long-standing advice that vulnerable groups should avoid raw egg. But because of improved food safety controls in recent years, the presence of salmonella in the UK eggs has been dramatically reduced in recent years. This means infants, children, pregnant women and elderly people can now safely eat raw or lightly cooked hen eggs or foods containing them that are produced under the British Lion Code of Practice. But these groups of people should still avoid raw or lightly cooked eggs that are not British Lion stamped, not hen eggs, e.g. duck or quail eggs, and are from outside the UK. In the US, the United States Department of Agriculture advises everyone against eating raw or uncooked egg yolks and whites or products containing raw or uncooked egg. No one should eat foods containing raw eggs. This includes health food milkshakes made with raw eggs, Caesar salad, hollandaise sauce and any other foods like homemade mayonnaise, ice cream or eggnog made from recipes in which the egg ingredients are not thoroughly cooked. Let's sum up with an all things nutrition review. Eggs are among the most nutritious food you can find, providing virtually all the vitamins and minerals you need. To top things off, eggs are cheap, taste awesome and go with almost any food. Adding eggs to your diet may be one of the easiest things you can do if you're trying to lose weight. They can make you feel more full and help you eat fewer calories throughout the day. Furthermore, eggs are a great source of many vitamins and minerals that are commonly lacking in the diet. How many eggs do you eat today? Let us know by leaving a comment below. If you like this video, you know what to do. Hit that like button and subscribe to watch more videos just like this. Remember, enjoy food and stay happy and healthy. Catch you on the next one.